Welcome to Movie Recap World, where boundaries blur and forbidden desires ignite. A brilliant doctor finds himself entangled in a web of secrecy. Today, we'll take a look at the second episode of the mini TV series called Obsession. So let's get started. William and Anna are watching each other, and after Anna touches William's body, they continue this love ceremony and lie down on the floor. Then Anna goes to the kitchen, takes wine, and says she has her own rules. She tells William that she will determine the time and that whatever happens in this room will never leave this room. William smiles, takes a sip of his wine, and Anna dresses while he takes a shower. In the meantime, William notices a red notebook and picks it up. Anna comes out of the shower, looks at him, and William apologizes and asks what's inside. Anna explains that it contains her thoughts, dreams, and things she doesn't want to forget. Later, William talks to Jay in his home garden. Jay tells him that he will surprise Anna with a trip to Paris. Later, while William is talking to other doctors at a party, he receives a message from Anna asking her to be at her house at 6 p.m. However, just as William is about to knock on the door, he sees the word don't come written. But when William knocks on the door, Anna's friend Peggy opens it and tells him that the house belongs to her. Then Anna arrives and tells him, I told you not to come. William says he just received the message now. When William returns home, his wife Ingrid embraces him and kisses him, expressing her confusion about their growing apart and asking if he has another relationship. William says he doesn't have a relationship and mentions that he is stressed because of work. Ingrid hugs him and kisses him. The next morning, while William is exercising, he receives a message and quickly goes to Anna's house. While they are experiencing another love ceremony, William asks Anna who she is and he wants to read her diary. Anna allows him and after they finish, William reads the diary and tells Anna that he is trying to understand their relationship and her relationship with her son. He then asks her if she knows that her son Jay came here. Anna says Jay respects her secrets. Upon asking Anna something that her son Jay doesn't know, Anna tells him that she had a brother who fell in love with her and after Anna rejected him, he committed suicide. William expresses his sadness upon hearing this and thanks Anna. When Anna asks if knowing this changes anything, William says no and Anna says maybe it should and gets up. William leaves the house and listens to music at home when Sally comes and asks if he's okay. William says he is fine and Sally asks him with surprise how long he has been listening to music. While Ingrid sits with William, she tells him that she's afraid Jay will do something foolish during the Paris trip, referring to Jay proposing to Anna. William says it's too early for that, and Ingrid expresses her fear of Jay's excessive attachment to Anna. William doesn't comment much and leaves the house. Later, William goes to Paris and sits in a restaurant. He reads a note that he secretly tore from Anna's diary and puts it in his pocket. As he looks outside, he sees Anna getting out of a car. He takes another sip of his wine and continues to watch, waiting there until evening. Jay offers champagne to Anna, and at that moment, Anna's phone rings. Anna hangs up the call, and when Jay asks if it's something important, she says no. The caller is William. Later, he calls Anna from the hotel phone and tells her he is waiting downstairs. Anna goes down, gets angry at William, and then they suddenly have romantic moments. After finishing their business, Anna tells William that she broke the rules and asks him to not follow her. Then she goes back to the hotel. When Jay asks if there's a problem, Anna lies about having a migraine and lies down in bed. When Jay asks if something is wrong, Anna's phone rings, but Anna shuts it off. The next morning, they leave the hotel and William is once again watching them from the restaurant. Later, he calls the hotel reception and asks to be placed in room 10. He enters the room, looks at the bed, takes off his jacket, rests his head on the bed, and then starts smelling it. He touches himself and then starts crying. Anna and Jay return from Paris and Anna expresses her desire to go home. Jay asks her to call him if she needs anything. Anna enters the house and sees that her mother is sleeping. She fills a glass of water and calls out to her mother. But when her mother doesn't wake up, she leaves the water and goes back to her room. She receives a message from Peggy on her phone asking, are you back? She meets up with Peggy and they go to a club and have drinks. Peggy asks why she returned from Paris early and if Jay did something wrong. Anna tells her about William's sudden arrival and confesses that William is Jay's father. Peggy reacts to this, so Anna gets up and goes home. One day while Anna is at work, she receives flowers at the office. She opens the note accompanying the flowers and smiles when she sees it's a note from Jay. She calls Jay and he invites her to his house for the evening. 
When Anna arrives home, Jay takes her to the balcony and starts cooking. Meanwhile, William, having dinner with Ingrid, receives a message on his phone that says, I know what you're doing, stop this creep. William calls Anna, and just as he is about to explain everything, Anna tells him that Jay has a chance to propose to her and asks for William's permission to say yes. After asking why, Anna tells him that she is happy with Jay and wants to be with him. William tells her to say yes, thanks her, and asks what he should say. William says nothing, hangs up the phone, and Anna goes to the terrace with Jay. Jay proposes to her, and Anna accepts. Meanwhile, William stands in shock in the living room while his wife Ingrid asks him if he is okay, and William says yes. And here we come to the end of the episode. If you like the content, don't forget to like the video and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.